the book of Alpha Running Man, homie. Read it or weep. Hey, what's going on, my Alpha Brethren? It's your man, Dr. BOA, aka Book of Alpha Running Me. And I want to just come in and drop some more game on you. Your need to be accepted will make you invisible. Now, what do I mean by that? I mean that we're all individuals. We all have our own purpose. We all have our own outlooks. We all have our distinctive qualities to bring to the world. That is why the majority of creators here have their own twist, their own unique sound, their own unique delivery, because we all bring something different to the world. But then there are those people who do everything in their power to go along, to get along, to be accepted. They want to be popular. They want to be liked. They want to be, you know, whatever descriptive term you can add to the life of someone who is a pleaser. That's not the way any of us should want to be because your need to be accepted will make you invisible. I'll get more into this right now. Let's chop it up. Now, the basic premise of being a people person is that you walk into a room and everyone is glad to see you and you know everyone loves you and everyone gives you accolades and everyone shakes your hand and pats you on the back and everyone wants to be around you and everyone you know everyone just loves you as a person you're, you're just the most amazing person anyone has ever met the thing is that's not the life of successful people Successful people enter a room and people flock to them, not because they like them, but because everybody wants to be close to success. Everybody wants to be close to a winner. Everyone wants to be close to the champion. Did you notice that the Golden State Warriors didn't have a parade this year? They had one last year. What's the difference between this year and last year for the Golden State Warriors? Last year, they were champions. This year, although they attained a level of success, they weren't champions. So they went home to lick their wounds and get prepared for next season. The Toronto Raptors, on the other hand, had a huge parade going through the middle of the city with the championship trophy, with their cell phones out, having fun, laughing, smiling. And there were thousands of people out there. You know why? Because those thousands of people wanted to be around success. So the need to be accepted is contrary to success. It is the opponent of success. Have you ever noticed that the, a whole lot of successful people are viewed as obnoxious jerks they don't really get along with people successful people don't have to get along with you they're on a level where getting along is not a benefit to them because people need them people need to be a part of their lives so never function on the need to be accepted Never listen to these guys who tell you that you need to be popular, you need to be well liked, you need to be, no, all you need to be is respected and desired. You see, we live in a world where as men, we can't function on emotion. We can't allow ourselves to be led by what we feel. So yes, being popular feels good. Being well liked feels good. But being respected and desired is good. That is what men want. See, a man doesn't want to be popular with women. He wants to be respected and desired. 
A real man doesn't care if women like him as long as they respect him and desire him. That's why a woman can be pulling the hair out of her head over a man, but get aroused to no end whenever she's in the company of that man, even though she knows, as women will say all the time, he's no good for her. Why is she with the man who's no good for her? Because she desires him. Because she respects him. Now the guy she likes, she spends time with him. But who is this guy? He's the guy she calls and spills her troubles with the guy who's not good for her too. So what we're talking about, man, is in this world, your need to be accepted will make you invisible. Will you totally disappear? But no, to the people who really matter in the world, you will be invisible. C Books had a vid up a while back called The Invisible Man. There's alpha, beta, select, non-select, however you want to put it, pimps and simps, and then there's The Invisible Man. The invisible man probably has this terrible need to be accepted. He doesn't even want a lot of women just so he can have a lot of women for his own selfish reasons like most of us do. He wants to have a lot of women so he can be popular, so people can know him as the guy who has lots of women. He needs to be accepted. And so everything he does, everything he says, everything he tries, is based on that one simple goal of being accepted. And that is why he is invisible. I'll give you a perfect example right now. You notice how the cold approach being beta or guys being against the cold approach has always been spoken of? I'm not saying these guys are invisible, but just listen to what I'm saying because they're anything, they're anything but invisible. But you ever notice how when I spoke on it, the manosphere went into an uproar. It's not like I, I reinvented the wheel with this thing. I simply spoke on something that has been spoken on before numerous times by numerous people. But I mean, I think I was the first one, but I say that to say this, I don't care about being accepted. I do my thing. I bring my light to the world. I don't want to put a damper or a dimmer on my own light to get along with some cats who don't want my light to shine. Yeah, everybody got their own light. So I say, instead of trying to get over there with all these other cats with their light, let me get over here by myself and let my light shine by itself. And you see what happens. I say something and it's responded to all over the manosphere by brothers who matter and some who don't. So I say this to you, man. For me, that was confirmation of my desire to shine my light in its own space. So never, never allow a need to be accepted to dictate your actions, to dictate your outlooks, to dictate your goals, because you will in effect be working very hard. I mean working your ass off to make sure that you're invisible. Not to the world at large, but to the people who actually matter. You may come in down below and let me know what you think about this topic, man. I look forward to hearing what you may have to say. I'm out.